Taipei Deputy Mayor Tsai bing Quen is currently in hospital after collapsing during a dinner party on Monday night. Tsai suffered a hemorrhagic stroke. He was found to be bleeding on the right side of his brain with some degree of midline shift. He underwent surgery for one and a half hours on Monday and is currently in an induced coma. Doctors say the coming week will be crucial for his health. When he arrived at the hospital, he was not conscious and he had a high blood pressure. Tests showed that he was bleeding profusely on the right side of his brain and that his midline had shifted. He was sent for emergency surgery to clear out the blood clots and relieve intracranial pressure. An intracranial pressure monitoring device has been attached. For now, he will continue to be sedated to control his blood pressure, brain pressure, and so on. This sedative treatment means that the patient is in a deep state of unconsciousness. Tai is 63 years old. The hospital and the city government have kept a low profile on his recent condition. It is unknown whether he had a history of high blood pressure, cholesterol, or blood sugar, or whether he was feeling stressed in recent days. Tai, whose background is in education, is a relatively recent newcomer to politics. He is often referred to as the most unpretentious figure in the Taipei city government.